Question 7. Place value and value of six-digit numbers. Let's study. The number below is said 315,000. Do you notice everything before the thousands column is said as we'd usually do? So we say 315,000 and then 642. Now we have our units, tens and hundreds column. Then comes our thousands. Then comes our ten thousands column. And even ten times greater than that is our new column, which is our hundred thousands column. So this number is 315,642. Number two, write down the value of each underlying digit. Now remember, value tells us how much a digit in a number is worth. So this 3 is in our 100 thousands place value column. Its value is 300,000. 300 with a gap and then three zeros for 1,000. If we look at D, this 4 was in our hundreds place value column. Its value is simply 400. If we look at H, this 9 is in the 100 thousands place value column. Its value is 900,000. So we leave a gap and then three zeros. Lastly, I. This 1 is in the tens place value column. Its value is just 10. Press pause to complete all of 2 now. Number 3. Write down the place value of each underlying digit. Now place value tells us which column the number is in. A, this 8 here is in our 100 thousands column. H for 100 and TH for 1000. If we look at B, this 2 is in the tens place value column. So I write a T for tens. Lastly, if we look at C, this 6 is in the thousands place value column, so we write TH. It's your turn to complete all of 3 now.